right, let's go. Part four, here we go. Part four. Okay. I have to figure out where to go now. Oh wait, no, this is where I have to hold my breath. to go this way? No. Bro. I don't want to have to go this way. No, I have to go this way. Oh, wait. So I can't go that way, okay. I have to go this way. Man. Yep, I have to go, I have to go this way. What do I do here? That's the question, right? Yep. Oh shit. All right.
my god. Oh my god. That scared the shit out of me. Not even joking. Oh shit. No 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 Oh god Oh shit, oh shit. No! room has guy written all over it in big sloppy letters nice card was vivian one of your stars okay last one I don't care. <clears throat> I just want to go to bed. I need to be alone. Someone couldn't even let her have her private life. That's creepy. That's a little creepy. Okay. That name, it's everywhere. That wasn't the real name. Yeah. This wasn't her life. Okay, is that all that's in here? Nothing from Hendrix? Okay, nothing. I'm gonna have to go through the mirror.
Okay, there's nothing over here. It's got to be over there. Yep, let me try over here. George's house, 69898, Mum, 899543, Neva Resort, 12, Okay, I've been all over this room. Ah, oh, there we go, wait. Partial number. One of these must have meant something. So do I just go back now? Back in there? That's a little weird. Okay. Bro, just... Whoa, what is going on? There we go. I'm supposed to go back this way now? No, that can't be it. That can't be it. Okay, so I, oh, I can't do anything else here. But go back in this bedroom, which I already did. And I already 
looked over here. Oh, this, that goes with the, uh, that's the piece of paper. There we go. There we go. A bunch of numbers, some would say. But I sense there was a lot more to them. Yep, there it is. Sleep? It's fine. I know you're busy. I'm busy too. Yeah, it's tomorrow. A big day. Yeah. Thanks. I'll see you home. Kiss them for me, okay? Not exactly a hotbed of passion. Yes. Yes, mother. I know. I'm doing my best. What? No, I... Well, what about my hard work? It's not always about you. Don't call me Victoria. You know I hate that. Victoria. There's her name. That was her given name. But not the real one. Not to her. Hello? Yes, this is Vivian. Room 347. I want to make a complaint. There was a man here. Yes, from the hotel staff. Frankly, I think I smelled vodka on his breath. He... What? That was the chief of staff? Uh, you know what? Never mind. Thank you. Well, it's a stressful job, I guess. Oh my god, Ellie! I thought you were... No, no, I'm... I'm really happy to hear from you. Why didn't you call sooner? You did? But... Eugene, that slippery son of a bitch. Ellie... She was very special to me. You don't need to be a medium to see it. So... If you were talking to Ellie, that means... Tori, it's you. The real you. That's your name. It made sense, really. A name is more than what everyone calls you. It's what you feel yourself to be. Now I can go to this door. There we go. There's the mirror. Oh, no. I'm back here again? be able to do anything here. We'll see. I'm not gonna lie. It felt good. Putting that curse of mine to good use. Moments like that used to keep me going. Now, I'm not sure I if I'm supposed to even be going this way anymore. What's my objectives now again? I gotta send away the souls, find a way to the day room, get the bolt cutters.
Yep, this is where I need to go. It's okay. You can be plain now. Tori. Thank you. Thank you. You did it, Marianne. Not from a lab. To a better place, I hope. Okay, so I need the bolt cutters. Hang on, hang on. Alright, so let's go over here. I need the bolt cutters. Mr. Rukovich is being unreasonable, to put it mildly. I'm a nurse, not a nanny. I understand that he needs someone to keep an eye on her, but I have my hands full as it is. Even putting aside all my other duties, there's poor Mr. Tarkowski to take care of. Still, I try to do my best. At least the girls keep quiet, keep to herself mostly. Like talking to her imaginary friends, but I figure it's quite normal for someone her age. Sometimes I can hear her playing a full conversation, and I'd swear it's like two people talking. She really is gifted. I guess it runs in the family. Interesting. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, it's out here. Yep. Got it. Got it. Got it. Interesting. Hello, my love. It's your favorite nurse. Are you in there? Even you spec that you left. I hope so. Cause I want you to be everything. Mm. out of the way. I gotta go down. Oops, wrong button. Thank <laughs> you. 
she's so funny. Or a movie star, like in a movie who don't use your real name for it. Yeah. Uh oh. I hear something. I keep seeing it in my dreams, the other place, dust and death, as far as the eye can see, a feeling of nothingness tearing at my soul. I wake up choking, feeling the dust of burning through my lungs. I beg for it to stop. He says there's no helping it. Then again, he would say that, wouldn't he? cinematic rather oh shit oh oh now we're at split screen there's sadness there's sadness But more. Yeah. Once it got out, we couldn't stop it. It ate all of them, Marianne. All of my friends. Your friends? I'm the only one left. It's, it's okay, Sadness. I'm here now. No, no. It, it'll eat you too. It, just like the others. I won't let it hurt you, I promise. Do you remember? No. Don't tell them. It's don't okay. tell anyone. You don't have to tell me. But you should still come with me so that I can keep you safe. No. No, Marianne. If that knows no, never again. Why did you... Bring me here. That is the question. There was something she wanted me to see. With my own eyes. to the day or I'm done. Oh, 
Okay, this is where I have to go into... Yep. bring the mouse down. Richard? Are you there? Uh oh. Wait, I think there's something over here. A sheet of music. Thomas, I've always been stunned by the depth and complexity of his imagination, mesmerized by the surreal dreamscapes his mind would weave. The way he described them, with every minute detail, it was as if he had actually witnessed all of it, as if something or someone pulled the veil and allowed him to peek beyond the edges of our reality. An angel? A demon? Is there really a difference? I know it didn't matter to me as his visions came alive on my canvas. Some would say I used the boy to fuel my waning creativity, but how could I not? To let this unique perspective, this bottomless well of inspiration go to waste, that would be an unforgivable sin. Interesting. Is there nothing over here? Interesting. Oh wait, yep, there's something here. Don't you think he would be better off in a nursing home? What about his family? 
Richard doesn't have any family. once you know i mean not that close but all right i'll take care of him follow me like a puppet isn't that what sadler said hmm. interesting interesting So once I find the key for over there, right? I'll have to put that one together. Okay, so I've already done that one. I remember the first time I met him, working a simple factory job. Still more of a boy than a man. Wide-eyed, constantly looking over his shoulders like a scared animal. His parents had died in the Warsong Uprising. Of what he'd gone through in the years that followed, he did not want to speak and I never pressed him. But it soon became clear, he had no one else in the world. I could immediately tell that despite his young age, he had seen things that no one his age should. I could immediately tell he was special. Anything else here? Yeah, there's nothing else here. There's something over here, though. Gather round, children. I want you to meet Lilia. Who's going to be joining our painting class? But why can't I play with my friends, Uncle Richard? Your friends? Oh, Eliane, I, I promised your father you would spend some time with the other children. Friends. Interesting. I spent a few years trying to steer him in the right direction. Trying to make him... Hey, how's it going, Pineapple? Trying to make him see the depth of his potential. He kept refusing, claiming that he was no painter and that he saw our little get-togethers as therapy, rather than artistic expression. Eventually, I wore him down. He agreed to enter the university, but on the condition that it would be chosen field. And so, he started on his way to becoming an architect. At first, I was rather skeptical, thinking he was throwing away greatness for mere except competence. But deep inside, I guess I was glad to be the only one to bring his vision to life. And then he met her. Our painting sessions became few and far between. He no longer needed my help in dealing with his inner demons. Sounds like some jealousy, maybe? Could be. Okay. Alright, so now let's go through that room. became a habit of ours. We'd sit down, sketchbook at the ready, and then he'd close his eyes and start talking, describing all the things he saw in his mind's eye, right, the third eye, the horror and splendor of the worlds beyond our own. What started out as an innocent exercise in imagination ultimately became a bottomless well of inspiration. My hand wouldn't dare rest, sketching furiously as he described the indescribable. For a while, I wondered why he was so eager to share his visions with me. To him, they seemed to be a burden, a source of great pain and distress. But finally, I understood. 
he sought to share them with someone who saw them as a source of beauty rather than madness. I kind of like that, I'm not going to lie. So it's incomplete. Why can't I go out here? Okay, so... the globe. Alright, so I'm gonna have to go through here in the spirit world, right? Oh shit. Okay. Okay, so this is what we gotta do. Oh, I don't have any charges though. Don't you think what about we were all right? I need charges, that's the question. I need charges, I can't get through there. charges I can't get through there oh okay I need to find her some charges because I cannot get through there without charges in the spirit And of course I can't go back. All right, so. over here. Well, yeah, it's incomplete, but I don't have anything for it. 
I can't. gotta be something like a sunflower or something. It doesn't look like it was open. I think I'm stuck actually. Because I know that I have to go this way, but I don't have enough spirit charges. Yep, I don't have enough spirit charge. So there's no way I'm getting through there. What do we investigate the day room? Okay. Having obtained a piece, using Marion's out of body, enter the room and pick up a wooden globe sitting on the shelf in the right hand corner of the room. I didn't see one. Okay, I did not see one over here. Let's see. The right hand corner. Oh, this. Okay, I see it. Yep, I see it. I see it now. What am I missing here? Oh. No. Make it go down. It needs to go down. Oh god. No. Y'all. No, this is the nose. No, no. Oh my god. Y 
Yes, there we go. Finally. Holy Jesus. Holy Jesus, y'all. Grabbing a drink, y'all. I'll be right back. Be right back. I'm back, y'all. Sorry. Okay. Right. Oh, shit. Do Here we go. The spark's too weak to absorb. It's like it's missing, missing something. something. Of course it is. Oh, I'm missing a music piece part. Okay, I'm missing a music piece. me of my childhood. At least the good parts. But the bad parts, they're always bad. Aren't they? You're a very smart girl, lady. You know that. You're special. Her voice, is that? Sadness. Sadness? It's Eliana. It's coming together. This is so weird. Cutting through this skin is so weird. Oh wait, hang on, there's something over here. Aha. Uh -huh. There's a key. God.
Okay, so now we're gonna have to go over here. No, because I still need the spark. I still... Okay. Nope. I gotta go to this room over here. Because I got the key. Come on, Richard. You were always there when I needed you. Let me return the favor. Ah, uh, I don't know. What about my work? The university? Richard, I know they kicked you out. I'm guessing you finally managed to piss off the right people. Stay with us, old friend. Do it for me. For them. So, he brought it here. Hmm. wonder what it meant by them. over here. So that's how you found me? Yes. He, he was, was just lying, lying there. there. He, uh, Mr. Echo? I, I'm sorry. He was a friend. I just... Uh, I need a moment. That's not true. Once he got engaged, we grew apart for a while. Now that I think of it, I guess I was jealous. I no longer had him all for myself. In time, I warmed up to her as well. She was striking, both in her beauty and intellect. Eventually, I accepted the fact that he was found, that he has found true happiness, true love, strong and pure. Well, as pure as it can be, I guess. In any case, I was no longer needed. When the project came along, the one, the one that would eventually be known as Neva, I pulled all my strings to get him what he wanted. Even though I knew it would drive an even bigger wedge between us, I wanted the best for him. He was the closest to a son that I'd ever have. It's kind of sad. Perfect E. to the piano. Oh, keep going the wrong way. Piano is this way because we close that entrance on the spirit side. So this is the only entrance open on the spirit side. Okay, so why can't I combine these? Y'all. Okay. E.
think. Okay, that is what I needed. Okay, now I can go over here. So, yep, I'm gonna have to redo this. I gotta do it with my Earth body too, I think. Damn it. I know what I'm supposed to do there. I know. No, I don't want to go through all that again. Did I get the music piece? What all do I have? Door. Oh, yeah, wait. Sparks too weak to absorb. But there we go. Missing something. That's what I need. No, go! I'm literally right there. Literally right there. I guess I have to run. I guess I have to run.
Richard, my arms are getting tired. You've been drawing me for hours. Almost done. You know, Lily, you remind me of something. Mm -hmm. A girl I knew when I was very young. Did you love her? Yes. With a young, innocent love, free of the ferocity of adult lives. Richard. Did you indeed fight? Yeah. I was finished. They had to let me go. Me, Richard Tarkowski, whose works were recognized across the continent, whose imagination, as they said, knew no bounds, whose very name became synonymous with fine art. All of that meant nothing to these soulless bureaucrats. To them, I was just a liability, the source of dangerous liberal ideas. I felt betrayed, empty. I needed to get out away from the hollow sickness of the city, but most of all, I needed a friend. And so, I sought him out. I knew his wife had died some months earlier. At the time, I thought it best to not interfere with his grieving. And so, now I feared that he'd hold it against me for not being there when he needed me the most. Instead, he offered me a home. Oh, there's something over here. Aren't you a bit old to be playing with dolls? Here, I bought it especially for you. Oh, a ribbon? It's beautiful. Thank you, Uncle Richard. Here, let me... Um, on the other hand, why don't you do it yourself? Uh, it's like... It's like something... One second, y'all. I gotta check something. Sorry, y'all. I freaked myself out for a second. I had to check something. Okay, let me follow. Did it go back up there, or was it this way, I think? First division of Thomas. Ah. Can't 
King damn it. No, I need to be sure. There's gotta be something around here. You are what? Alright, so it's like, who's he talking to, right? Fuck! So it's the other version of him, he's like her. Surprise! You know what? You're not the one. Just tell me what you see. Come on. So he's like her. Oh, well, be real fucking specific. Hey, I'm trying to help here. <laughs> you know, sometimes I wonder. Doesn't make it easier when you keep me in the dark for so long. Thanks for that, by the way. <laughs> Hell of a way to treat your soulmate. Damn it! There's nothing here. There is. Really? You're never wrong about nothing. Screw this. It's a sunflower. What? You building tension? Grab the fucking thing! Would you shut up? Like he's obsessed. Mm-hmm. Kind of yep, kinda crazy, right? Bastard! Who could he? Uh oh. I told you we couldn't trust anyone but ourselves. Keep it together. Think. What do we do now? Anyway, I'm not looking back. Oh, whoa, 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 easy, Riley. Remember what I say.
Oh shit. Expecting you. Uh oh. It's, it's getting there. real. Everything all right, my friend? Did you see it? Friend. Did I? What? My daughter. My 13 year old daughter. I never trusted her. Thomas. Did you do it? I. I don't. I was a sketchbook. Forced myself to look through it. Oh, God. Cover to cover. Every single fucking page. I'll let you go. I... It wasn't me. Thomas, you have to understand. There's this thing inside of me. Shut up. Oh, ah! there it is. Oh, oh. <laughs> you have to believe me. I wanted to die. I'll make it quick. Thomas, I'm so sorry. She's my daughter! <laughs> I never wanted any of this. Oh, God. You should never have come here. But you did. No one should be here. Knowing what she means to me. Thomas, I, I swear. I'll go away. You'll never. Wait. Fuck you. No. Let me out. Let me out. Let me. This is creepy. <laughs> oh shit. Thomas? Free Richard from his All demons. Right, Richard. This is your world. Interesting. with these tentacles though that's the thing right okay just before the hit to counter attack Terrible happened here. It should 
Just it's Richard. And with that, we will end it here and continue another day. I must say, this is getting really interesting. The storyline has been absolutely amazing. Kind of a trigger warning for me. I don't know about anybody else, but wow, this has been done so well. So, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Um, in the comments below hit the thumbs up if you're on my youtube if not follow me on twitch at twitch.tv forward slash tarot underscore with underscore trisha i stream live there um very often through the week so please shoot me a follow over there and if you're on youtube shoot me a subscribe and hit that bell for notifications for when i go live thank y'all so much and have a good rest of your night or day